Last week at MWC, LG handed us the G6 the day before it was announced. Since the phone isn't on sale yet, we're not quite ready for a full review, but we have spent quite a bit of time with the phone's cameras. I'm Nick Gray from Fandroid, and this is our first look at the cameras on the LG G6. The back of this phone sports dual 13 megapixel sensors. The first features a 71 degree f1.8 aperture lens with three axis optical image stabilization and phase detect autofocus. The second sports a 125 degree f2.4 wide angle lens. This means you can capture shots like you would with any other smartphone, but if the shot is too cramped, you can zoom out to the wide angle lens and pretty much fit in the entire world. The 5 megapixel camera on the front features a 100 degree f2.4 wide angle lens. It's not as wide as the one on the back, but it's perfect for selfies and wide enough to fit in your friends and your surroundings. I could bore you with a lot more details of the cameras of the LG G6, but rather than doing that, let's just jump in and see what the camera can do. As you can see, the cameras on the LG G6 are pretty amazing. The front facing camera could use a little bit of work in low lit conditions, but when the sun is out, shots turn out pretty good. But the real highlight is the dual camera on the back of the G6. Being able to zoom out to the wide angle lens completely changes the way that you take pictures. While sightseeing in Barcelona, I honestly used the 125 degree wide angle lens a lot more than the standard 71 degree lens since it allowed me to frame my shots differently than I typically do. 
Due to the higher f-stop, the wide-angle lens doesn't pull in as much light when you're indoors or at night, but there are no issues when lighting conditions are good. If you want consistency, the G6's standard lens delivers every single time. It doesn't matter if you're taking a picture of a moving object, directly into sunlight, or in a dark alley in the middle of the night. If you want to see the full resolution images shown in this video, click the link in the description below. For more coverage of the LG G6 and our upcoming review, don't forget to subscribe.